Hi, my name is Brother Etienne. I'm a monk of Conception Abbey. One of my hobbies is actually uh, photography. Uh, it's been one of my interests for quite a number of years. I got started um, when my parents actually bought me uh, a nice Pentax film camera uh, out of high school, and I had kind of dabbled in that a little bit. Uh, afterwards, when I was looking for a job, I ended up getting a job at a place called Lawrence Photo in Wichita, Kansas, run by Paul Hudson. Uh, and I was a salesman for them. And they sell uh, professional cameras, equipment, supplies, those types of things. And so that really deepened my ability to appreciate good photography. Some of the different types of photography that I enjoy uh, is, you know, things like landscape, um, architectural, those, you know, kind of your common ones. The one that I've gotten uh, better at and one on ones that I've gotten really focused on is called macro photography. And so what I do is, is, is actually extreme macro photography where I do super close up images of different uh, objects, creatures, things like that. Some of the things that I like to do are, um, let's say like snowflakes. Well, I'll take photographs of individual snowflakes. Uh, I'll take photographs of things like grasshoppers or butterflies or um, you know dragonflies, things that I find in nature that allow me to be extremely close and capture something that most of the time people won't see. I also like doing things like inanimate objects um, with lots of form, like you could take a pop can, take the picture of a top of a pop can and come out with an amazing picture when you get that close. Now macro photography is a little bit more difficult than normal in terms of you have to have special equipment. Uh, some of that equipment will include things like a macro lens if you can get one. Uh, I have a 50 millimeter uh, old uh, macro lens. And then from there I also use extension tubes. Extension tubes allow the camera uh, and the lens to be separated from each other so that you can have a shorter focal length. Basically you can get really close to your image. And then also things like a flash extender. I built a flash extender with a Pringles can. Uh, and so I can do a lot of things um, without breaking the bank, so to speak. And they come out really well uh, and really interested. And they really open up a world that most people never get to see. Photography for me as a monk works well because it allows me to uh, have a hobby that doesn't cost a whole lot of money once you get it set up. and then. There's tons of experiences around here for me to, to photograph people, uh, events, and then the fact that we live out uh, around nature, uh, and the fact that I like doing nature macro photography, uh, it affords me uh, huge numbers of um, opportunities to just to practice without having to uh, go to exotic places.